Here in Portland, we are proud to have the Portland Museum of Art, and we were fortunate once again to attend the Midsummer Party put on by the Contemporaries. The Contemporaries are a young, diverse group of entrepreneurs, creators, and community leaders that not only get to enjoy art, network together, but also support the museum. So we went to the party this year. The pressure is on. Yes, I did not go. You to be a contemporary. But it's my 2017 goal by the end of the year to be a contemporary and join that great community of uh, local supporters of the Portland Museum of Art. Absolutely. So. And I, although I have to say, Kevin, last year they had a midsummer white party. So you I, might I, I have to change your I wardrobe. Lost. It's all right. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take a look. You want to make your dance? Oh, you want me to dance? No. You want to do a little salsa? You want to do a salsa? No, it's no. all good. Okay. We all need to work on our salsa moves. You first, honey. Um, I'm Issa Rothband, and this is Judd Rothband, my husband, and we're members of the museum. Contemporaries was one of the first groups that I joined when I moved to Portland like 11 years ago or so. I was looking for a place to go to meet people, but also somewhere that um, spoke to a lot of my interests, like art specifically. Um, and so I've been a member ever since. I love a party. And this is a classy one. Look at this place. It's incredible. There's like live interactive art displays. There's incredible live music. Everyone's dressed up. People are looking and feeling good. And I love it. This is a great scene. So being a contemporary means that um, I'm making a donation to an organization I really care about. As a contemporary member, I get access not only to the museum and many other museums out there in the world, but also a, a legion of cool friends. There's a lot of people here tonight I don't get to see on a day-to-day -day basis or week to week or month to month, but we know that we can convene here every so often, every quarter, however often the parties are, and we can talk about our respective lives and you know job opportunities and the work we're doing, but also the arts first and foremost. So it's an opportunity to really kind of geek out on art. Fundamentally, there's a love of the arts and you know a wanting to be involved and give back. And that's how I describe it. So true. Just been such a great sense of community when I moved back to Maine over four years ago. I found like really sense of like home and with friends, and it's just I really find that here at the Portland Museum of Art. It's obviously such a cultural gem for the city. It has to be supported. If we're not supporting it, who will? We're really the next generation, so that's why we're here today. Yeah, we live in Portland. We live two blocks away. We walked here. We have a four and a half year old son. We want him to make sure that this institution is here when he grows up. Yeah, it's really a credit to the leadership here and what's going on. Having fun? Oh yeah. Always. Absolutely. <laughs>